Hello there and welcome once again to Red Gaming Tech. My name is Amata, today is the 8th of July and I'm here once again to give you a daily dose of the latest gaming news. Today I have some news for you concerning Aliens Colonial Marines, which I'm guessing is not a game you expected to hear mentioned pretty much ever again, but it has pretty much been confirmed that Sega will be releasing a DLC for the game by the name of the Stasis Interrupted pack, and this will of course be available as part of the Season Pass, but the add-on has yet to be dated or priced as a standalone DLC. So it might just be something that they've been working on uh, for those who bought the Season Pass, but I'm not confident that they want to actually sell it as a price to be a piece of DLC, or they just haven't actually decided when they want to release it for the public who have not bought a Season Pass. Either one is possible. The first one seems more likely, though, given the rather tarnished history of this particular game. And this news has come to us because the DLC for the... Um, the trophies for the DLC, excuse me, have been outed by the game, the website, ps3trophies.org, and I'll go through those with you now. And that's thank you, that will be all. Complete stasis interrupted at any difficulty, I'm happy to disappoint you. Complete stasis interrupted in Ultimate Badass. We're still collating. Find all stasis interrupted audio logs. I only need to know one thing, find your family. They can bill me, destroy the legato. I don't go all day, sever the umbilical cord without missing a shot. They're dead, okay, can we go now? Kill the lurkers in the Sulaco engineering. Now what you're supposed to do, escape the FDL ship. We are leaving, survive the queen escape. It's the only way to be sure. Destroy all samples in the labs of the queen module. I have to say, um, I was a little bit surprised to see that they will be releasing DLC for this game, given their rather negative reaction that it got upon release for very good reason as well and rightfully so to be honest because Aliens Colonial Marines is probably one of the most colossal failures in recent years and perhaps this DLC has been something that was planned and worked on for a while and was just sort of there being worked on as they were waiting for classification da 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 and then obviously the game came out and everyone hated it so now this DLC was just kind of sitting around like well uh what do we do now? So maybe they're just going to release it because, well, it's made. They may as well, and it'll just be out there for the people with the season pass. Um, I do wonder if they'll actually date and price it as a standalone release. I think they may, just because, well, they don't really have anything to lose by doing so. Um, I mean, it's not exactly very likely that many people are going to pick this DLC up outside of those who have the season pass. And even those people are probably going to be like, no, <laughs> I'm not going to play that game ever again. And to be honest, I wouldn't really blame them. Uh, but be interesting to see what the reaction is. I'm looking at some of the comments um, for this particular piece of news, and well, not many people seem to care. And well, the ones that do care are not very happy with the game or what it did for the Aliens name and slash franchise. And to be honest, as a huge fan of the original film and all of the other Alien, most of the other Alien games that have come out in recent years, you know, we've had some good ones, we've had some bad ones, but you know, the last Aliens game that came out was actually pretty good, so this one was a colossal failure, at least in my opinion, so personally, um, I will not be getting this DLC, and I'm sure most people who actually own the game are going to feel the same, even if they do end up releasing it as a standalone pack. would be curious if anyone's actually going to, I highly doubt it, but we'll see be curious to know either way anyway that's me done for this video hope you've enjoyed it thank you very much for watching i'll see you next time